we're on our way down to the uh, Verizon Wireless Center for the day's video blog. We're going to shoot it down there. But as I'm driving down there, I'm just I'm thinking about doing a Facebook shout out. I want to make sure I get my sister in there this week. Uh, happy birthday to my sister. She's a cop. Watch out. Uh, happy birthday to her. She's watching the video blog right now, probably while she's on duty eating donuts. <laughs> I also want to give a shout out to B. Uh, give a shout out to our good friend Hendrix here running the camera with. Nah, we're coming up with a roundabout. What's with all the. They're building like seven roundabouts in the Mankato area in the next few weeks. Did you know that? Like seven. We're Americans. We don't believe in roundabouts. What am I, like, merge? What am I merging for? I don't, okay, all right. Gotta go around, apparently. Gotta go around. I'm going left to go right. Make sense of this roundabout. Make sense of this. <laughs> left. With an arrow that turns left. So should I turn left here? I don't know. I think I, I, think I go straight. Okay. I'll go this way. And I want to go this way. So I got to stay in this lane. And no, I wanted to go there. But I can't go there because it didn't tell me I could go there. But I'm slowing down for this car. This guy doesn't know what he's doing either. Okay. No, wait. I don't want to go that way. I want to go that way. What is the purpose of this roundabout? Nobody asked me if they could put this in here. Why does nobody ask me this stuff? Okay, now do I have to get in that lane? I should have been in that lane. This is not going well right now. All right, I think I can get out here. No, nope. no. Nope. How many times can you go around a roundabout? Ah! Okay, I'm gonna get out here. I'm exiting, I'm exiting. I'm dizzy. I'm now dizzy and dangerous behind the wheel. Hey everybody, welcome to Video Blog 47 on location again today as we're hanging out at the Ryzen Wireless Center and they're making ice. Check that out. They're dead. Want to, want, want to be interviewed? I bring in Ted. You remember him from such video blogs as uh, Ribfest for preparation? He was there. I have two questions because like, right now the guy's just got done hosing off the ring. So how does this work? There's like a AC, is there like a fridge underneath here, like a freezer? Well basically underneath the concrete are uh, uh, tubes that have uh, Freon in it. And it chills the floor down to about 13 to 18 degrees. Is it Freon with some fluorescent light bulbs? Yeah. Okay. So then we'll have to chill it down to uh, where it starts freezing on the ice or the floor and then we'll just start spreading water on it. Spraying water in a fine mist until it builds up a little bit then we uh, spray white paint on it basically, it comes with power form. Oh yeah, paint. It's, it's paint, it's not yep. the color of the ice, just layered up. Uh, it starts flooding like he's doing now with the hose there. So they don't just let the hose run and let it flood on its own, no, they just kind of spray no, it, make no. their way around and spray it. It's really a science because of the way the ice, the water crystals form. I don't know, it's a big science that I don't understand. I'm just a tech guy. The lights, you know, go out. <laughs> oh, okay. Once it reaches about a half inch or so, then we start bringing the Zamboni out on it and flooding with that. Oh, can I drive the Zamboni? No. All right, cool. Well, thank you, Ted. Yeah, you're thank welcome. You. Have fun, guys. We're going to get on the Zamboni later. Now let's talk about Maverick Hockey. Ready to go, new coach. Ready for the new season. I'm pumped. The season actually starts uh, with exhibition on Sunday already, if anybody can believe that. I'm excited for Maverick Hockey. The NHL better get their stuff in gear, otherwise I'm really going to be upset. But otherwise, go Mavericks! Maverick, go! Screw this. I'm getting on the ice. All right. So I kind of started nosing around a little bit to find out. <laughs> I wanted to see more of the arena since nobody's here besides the ice crew. Down there the guy is working his hose. High up, they don't want to fall over or anything, you know? That's it for Vinny Vlog 47. Make sure you guys check back next week. We're doing another one. Getting closer to 52 and I got a big surprise for you. And if it beats the fact that I'm on top of the world right now, it's probably going to be pretty awesome. You got to check it out. Thanks for watching the video vlog. Links, Facebook, Twitters, things. Check them out. Like them. Follow them. Thanks to Ted. Bye. All right. We're about ready to leave the Verizon Center. But before we go, let's get on one of these things to take off with the thing.